the internet so today we're going to try and fix the Elden Ring resolution problem so here's the problem and we will try and fix it so it's the resolution problem where it's bloated and you can only see like a quarter of the screen you're about to see it right now all right hopefully we can fix it if not then you probably won't see this video okay so as you can see it is bloated and we only see a portion of the screen so obviously we can't play like this so we're just gonna exit out and quit the game and we're gonna try some solutions alright so this is what we've come up with yes I know we're using Claude AI but nothing else works so sometimes when you're that desperate you gotta use what you gotta use so they're saying the first thing is copy and paste your monitor resolution so 1920 and 1080 seems to be the same resolution as my monitor so that's good okay so what we need to do is go to steam go to library go to games and then go to properties so right click properties launch options copy and paste the width and height of our monitor then I guess enter and exit so that should lock it in alright so if that doesn't work we will do the next thing that they tell us to do what's the worst thing that can do break the game I mean I can't play it right now so there so the worst thing is nothing happens or I guess the worst thing is the game breaks and I have to re-download it but probably okay so is it working mm. yes no okay all right so moving on to the next one so that didn't work for me but it might work for you guys all right so what is the next step okay step two all right so copy that okay yes I'm putting my faith into AI all right so put that into the loading bar is that called a loading bar now the folder address bar whatever that is all right so it takes me here okay open the graphics config dot XML which is this look for the screen resolution settings so I need to go to my settings minimize okay so display settings so mine is 1920 okay all right so and then change the values and save the file okay okay what am I doing so first I need to I believe open this up have a look at it and then open it up with notepad to save it so first let's just open it up double click okay so all right right off the bat we see a problem so the window screen is our full screen okay but then the secondary is a resolution higher than mine so that's no good all right cool so exit so now we know what to do all right so that means we need to edit in notepad so right click on that XML file or I guess it's a HTML depending how you look at it basically it's just a website but it's a website with text okay so we've got this 1920 and 1080 
So we want to replace everything that is not that. So, okay. Maybe it would be a good idea to open one and then edit, and then we can close both. That would probably be a good idea. So we can compare the book, compare the two. Okay. So first one's all good. So when everything's in white text, it just makes it really hard to like see what's going on. Okay, so copy the 1920 and replace the 3840 and do that for both 3840 and then copy and paste the 1080 and replace the 2160 okay all right don't mess with anything else press control save or control s to save then exit so oh yeah I just had that extra file open just in case I messed something up. Um, don't worry about that. Okay, so now we can close this. All right, so save it. And I suppose we just exit out of everything. Okay, so open up Steam once again. Okay, that was pretty quick. Hit play. Please work. If it doesn't, well, you won't see this video, like I said. If it does, nice. We can give a win to the AI chatbot. Okay. Okay. Still waiting. Oh. I guess that fixed it. Cool. So, yeah. All right. So, continue game. Please work. So far, so good. Okay. Cool. All right. So, movement's good. Let's open up the menu. Menu is good. Okay. So monitor, resolution, yep. Everything's good. So there we go. I think we fixed it. So, yep. Movement. Okay. Let me just quickly just check everything. So, yep. Everything's all good. Can zoom in, zoom out. I can move, I can see everything, so it seems like it's all good. So there we go. That's how we fix it. So give one point to the AI chatbot. I know everyone hates the AI chatbot, but sometimes when you've gone through Google and Google hasn't got the answers, Reddit hasn't got the answers, sometimes when you're desperate, Desperate means calls for desperate measures. So I'm happy. All right, we can exit out of the game. And just to check it again, we'll open up the game once again, just to prove that it's not a coincidence. And yeah, so that's cool. Now we know. Okay, do excuse my computer, it takes like 30 seconds to figure out that it has to quit Elden Ring. All right. So let's just open it up again. And just to check that it's not a coincidence, not like some miracle. So if it works again, I'll show you the process. And if it doesn't, well, like I said, you won't be seeing this video if it doesn't work. All right, so it's looking good. Okay. Okay, we see the full logo. That's a good sign. 
Okay, we've got the Elden Ring. Okay, continue game. Okay. Everything's good. We can move, we can see. Okay, everything's looking good. Okay. Check our menus. Menus good. Okay, everything's to the correct resolution, proportions. Okay. Alright. Cool. Let's just check systems. Full screen. I don't want to mess with anything. It's working right now, so that's all good. Okay. Let's quit the game. Yes, I'm aware we can return to desktop straight away, but I want to save the game and just be safe and... Yeah, not jinx anything. Okay. Alright. So now that we've confirmed that it's working and we've tested it again to confirm that it's not a coincidence, so it's not magic. Okay. Alright, so now we can recap on how to fix the Steam resolution error or bug, I suppose, for Elden Ring and any other games. Okay. So what we did was we copy and pasted this um, string of ticks into our address bar or our folder bar. So it's just this thing right here. So we copied that and it takes us to this location. So we opened up our graphics config and what I did was I opened up one just to see what's going on because the blue and white text is contrasting so I can see exactly what's going on. You don't have to do that. And then what I did next is I right click the graphics config and edit in notepad. So as you can see, everything's in white and it makes it a little bit hard to see. So I just compared what's going on here with the notepad version. And as you remember, we had 1920 and 1080, but then these two resolutions were like 3K, 3K and 2K. So they were bugged or like they were configured that way for some reason. I don't know why, but all we had to do was just copy and paste the, the width and height into both of these. And then we saved it and we exited out and then we close Steam, reopen Steam, and we just hit the play button and it worked. So yeah. Okay. So option number two works. Option number one doesn't work. And we haven't tried option three and four. But since option two works, we're just going to stop there. We don't need to do anything else because it solved the problem. So I will copy and paste step number two in the pinned comment so you guys can do it yourself. And don't be afraid if you miss. So obviously just have a copy in case. So as you can see, I have like a copy of the original just in case anything got messed up. So I can just like go back to it and just copy and paste the old version and then everything's okay. So this isn't really too technical, but if you're afraid of messing up, just copy and paste this onto your desktop as a backup. And if you mess up, just delete the broken one and just replace it with the old one that you've copy and pasted onto your desktop, just as a precaution. But as you can see, I just followed those steps and I opened up the graphics config just to see what's going on. And then I right click and edit notepad because I saw there was some discrepancy with the resolutions. Okay. All right. So I think that's it. Um, 
All right. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Okay. Until next time. See ya.